So welcome back. I'm with my friend Jeff. Well, where are we coming back from? Don't worry about that. Uh, we're on a little adventure. We're on our way to Kelly Island in the middle of Lake Erie. We got some cool stuff planned. We're about two hours away. We're gonna spend the night there, do some camping, explore what's out. Not a lot, it's not a big island, but we're gonna go check it out. It's like two miles across the whole island, so. And also on top of all that, I'm testing out my Sony ZV-1. I have not really oh, yeah. been able to use this. Um, but yeah, in for the ride and excited and to see what's in store. So we're at our first stop. We decided to take a little stop in Toledo, Ohio. Never really explored here. Jeff and I both talked about how we drive through all the time, but never actually stopped. So we're at this little park. I don't know, we're gonna get some cool shots. We'll explore out this park. I don't know, we'll see what's up. Check out this little green rooftop. You can see it. Wow. Oh, there's like a conference going on and everything. I have not seen people work in person in so long. Wow, that's kind of a great spot. This little, this little conference center. Wow. All right, so now we're gonna take a quick little lunch break here in downtown Toledo. Get some bagels, I don't know. It's very nice. Yeah, weather's getting nice. Okay, some good luck from Toledo. I can hear you like perfectly. Yeah. It sounds like you're like on the radio right now. I can't hear like where you're coming from, but I can just hear you. It sounds like you're coming directly behind me. Quick little pit stop. We're right next to this awesome looking nuclear power plant. We're gonna try to fly the drone. Also just like huge fields. Jeff, what do you think they're growing? What is this? All right, so we just got to Marblehead, Ohio, taking the ferry across to Kelly Island. That's where we're going. That's where we're going. It's 
Puddin Bay over there. Mainland Ohio behind us. Cedar Point around the... Uh, yeah, I don't know if you can see Cedar Point. Is that it? Yeah, you can see the dragster back there. over to our campground in the state park. Oh, wow, look at this. Whoa. Oh, all right, we made it to our campsite. One little picnic bench. Yeah, not too bad. The tent is done. Jeff, getting the hammer out. Hammer time. All right, so we're gonna go over to the beach. Check out Lake Erie, see what's going on. Jeff, what'd you, what'd you find over here? I, we're not talking about an oven. It looks like an oven. Is that actually just an oven? It's a little unsettling for, for us. We'll ignore that and hope it's not a sign. All right, so one of the highlights of the island is glacial grooves. Found these huge rocks carvings. I don't know if you know more, Jeff. No, I don't. <laughs> All right, so apparently from what we just read, about two million years ago, glaciers formed during the ice age started receding and melting and started flowing back towards Canada. And these are like the rock grooves carved out from those glaciers. The tracks, the tracks of the glaciers. Yeah, exactly, the tracks. And they claim to be the most famous glacier grooves in the world due to its accessibility and size. It's a three and a half acres. Whoa. That is nuts. I did not expect to see that, did you? Well, yeah, I saw, I googled it. Ah, oh, you. <laughs> yeah, you think that's real?
This like feels like like Southeast Asia, like a jungle, like an abandoned like ruins. You played Uncharted, right? Yes, this, oh. yes. This gives like, Uncharted this vibes. Uncharted. Yeah, I kind of like this on Nate. I use it all the time. Oh, should we go in the creepy tunnel? What is in it? Oh, there's like chairs. All right, so that was an old quarry, a stone crusher. Take the rocks from the quarry that crushed it down to small size and process it. But so far, a pretty pretty mind blown of such a grand structure and like. A small island in the middle of Lake Erie. All right, the sunset views in the water, unbelievable. Check us out.